sorry I'm chewing this gum like a damn horse, okay? But it's good. Customer service, zero out of 10. But I be having to block people sometimes. Oh, it's giving. I'm giving Coco Jones at the BET Awards. Don't play with me. Ooh, it's giving a little rough. But you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. So today is Tuesday. And I'm just starting off the vlog kind of early this week, I guess. I don't know. I said I want to start picking up the camera more and just kind of like vlogging, like whatever I'm doing, just get my content. So, um, I'm kind of like upset right now because I don't even know if I'm going to be able to recover my information. Y'all probably don't have a clue in the world what I'm talking about. But no, for real, I have to recover my, um, some content that I made on this, um, Oh my gosh, on this USB drive, y'all. And I really hope when I stick it in my computer, it lets, it allows me to at least get my stuff off here because this is like done. Like, I don't want to speak anything negative, but I'm like, if I get my stuff out here, I'm going to be shocked. I'm gonna update y'all on that. I just got back from running a few errands and I just wanted to show you guys a few things that I picked up from the store. <sighs> I said that I was going on a no buy and I really need to, but this is it. Like, I gotta get this stuff in my Shein car and then I'm gonna be good, I'm gonna behave. So I stopped by Sephora and I picked up the Dior Attic Lip, Lip Maximizer. <clears throat> yeah, and then I got the shade Raspberry. I wanted to see what this is like because it's supposed to give you like that um, tingling sensation. This is so freaking pretty, y'all. It's really the packaging for me. Like, ta-da, this is gorgeous. Like, you gorgeous. Focus. I'm kind of ready for a new camera. It's supposed to kind of give you like a lip plumper. And it reminds me of my Fenty Heat, but to me, this one is just a little bit more pink, which is what I wanted. Like, juicy, my lips look better. Like, I wanted something that I could wear um, with lipstick and lip liner and then something I can just wear by itself with nothing and then something I can just wear with um lip liner. It feels good and I definitely feel the um the plumping effect. I love the way this looks. Like I love the way it gives my lips some color. Super pretty. Can y'all really tell? Hold on. <laughs> yeah. It kind of gave me a little color girl. Anyway, that is so cute and I love the shade Raspberry on me. So pretty. Then I stopped by Victoria's Secret, y'all. And they're having their semi-annual sale and they had their panties five for $20, five for $19.99. And of course, I needed to get me some new panties. I really should be buying smalls at this point because, but I just don't know. Like I just kind of feel comfortable in a medium. I don't really want my drawers too tight. You know what I'm saying? Damn. I mean, are they supposed to be tight? <laughs> I guess it just depends on what kind of, what cut you wear. Like if you went in the thong. But no, girl. Like I don't think I ever had my, because I think when your drawers be too tight, like when you like walking, people can see like your, like your panty line. And that ain't cute. We ain't going for that. I don't know. But the panties I wear, um, this may be TMI. Or maybe I should just show y'all. Okay. I can show y'all. It ain't, it's never that serious. Let me show y'all what I got. So, um, these are my favorite underwear. Mm-hmm. And I love the Victoria's Secret Cheeksters. I don't like the pink. I like Victoria's Secret because I'm a grown woman. And I just like solid color panties. Like, just give me one color. I don't need the rainbows and the, and the um, flowers on it. I'm good. I got a yellow pair. I got another of the burgundy pair. And then, well, I got six. And I was just like, I don't care. Just charge me whatever. And I think they were like, she said it was $4. So it was still good. Got a black pair. And then I picked up me these nude thongs. Super cute. And then they have Victoria's Secret along the band. And then got these white ones. Yeah. And then I got this cute white bra. I thought that was cute. And then I think I needed a, not a white bra. So, so like if I wear like a see-through shirt or something. Like if the shirt is like white or bright. I just kind of needed a white bra. Why am I trying to justify? 
I'm over here trying to explain to y'all why I've been to all these stores and I had no business. That's what I'm trying to explain. But anyways, what's new? Um, I got Casey some school shirts, y'all. Old Navy had their uh, uniform shirts for four dollars, and um, it's like the smooth kind. And then I think I picked him up one of like the regular textured ones. Like it's not like satin or nothing. It's coffee. What am I talking about? When I say the smooth kind, not like um, satin or like uh, polyester, but they're made out of cotton, but the design is just different um, than this one right here. This one is like textured. These are the ones that I normally buy um, him for school. I got one of those. I was I had more, but they had to cancel my order because they didn't have the items um, inside of the store. So I got him five uniform shirts for like $20 or under $20, so that was a really good deal. And then we went into um, Oshkosh Carter's to get him. They just had this cool shirt. I thought it was cute. It's got LA on it and super cute. Wear that with like some shorts, some joggers. And I just picked up these joggers because I really like this color when I went in there last time. I just um, didn't get it. So I got it this time. They still didn't have black. I could have ordered it like um, for like pickup or like, what am I talking about? <laughs> ship to home, y'all know what I'm talking about. I could have actually did like a ship to home in store, but I was like, whatever. I think he already got one pair of black. I just wanted him to have another one. Then I had a CVS order. I'm super excited about this because I don't even use um, makeup wipes anymore y'all but i feel like these are gonna come in handy for me like i'm gonna put these like in my beach bag i'm gonna even put some of these in my car and stuff girl because sometimes when i'm out and i'm out late and stuff sometimes i want to take my makeup off like i just want to take it off right there right then right now like get it off of me so um i picked these up fragrance free neutrogena and they're the single, so they come like singly packed, which is really good. Cause I was gonna buy like a pack, but I'm like, I can't throw them into bags and throw them where I need them if they in packs. So this is genius. Like Neutrogena, yeah. Y'all did y'all big one. I got some spoons. It's nothing, girl. Some toothpaste for Kaysen. He just used the Colgate cavity protection. Some travel toothpaste for me. But when I travel, I love this to clean out my um, toilets. My favorite toilet cleaner. Another toilet brush, a nice little bicky, and it's purple. Cute, cute, cute. My battery's dying, so I'm talking fast. I got some bowls, some tissue for case and bathroom, and I also picked up these leggings from Victoria's Secret. Super cute workout leggings, you guys. I gotta find the top to go with them. And then we went by Great American Cookie, and we got cookies. Casey got um, a sprinkle and a strawberry marshmallow or something and then i also picked up these from dollar tree my battery is about to die let me go put this stuff up i'm gonna talk to y'all later so how long you gonna take, take to get that two bag two. Okay. that'll be enough time for me to come back and make my bag right this shit say three hours and 35 minutes ain't no way to my husband yeah that's all like okay well, well it's before my house ain't it what <laughs> I haven't been here so long. Which way is it telling you to go? Right here, you booking right? Oh, right here? Yeah. Okay. And yeah, you go all the way down and then you make a right. How you turn the volume down? They turn your shit down. Dad, like, where you got me at? We in, like, the boom dog. Yeah, for sure. We in a church. Yeah, that's what it's giving. But the food gonna be a 10 out of 10 watch. It's kind of like a little hidden gem um, in my city. So, y'all, we just pulled up to, wait, I'm gonna be demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. But um, you can park anywhere for real. For. Go around this way and see if any park. But we just made it to the Capital Seafood Oyster Bar, y'all. The food be bust down. I'm about to get some shrimp. It's gonna be so good. I haven't had it in so long. Gonna be greedy. I know, ain't it? Yeah. I ain't gonna tell y'all everything. God, leave balance. I ain't been doing good in my balance. I've been eating like crazy, y'all. Like I've been not doing too well. Okay. 
I need to do what I'm supposed to do. But at least I've been kind of going to the gym, but I only went to the gym one day this week. <laughs> Look how you see it, it's so shy. Yeah, I'm kind of shy, but that's okay. I kind of wanted to gain a little weight anyway, but healthy weight because it can go where it's not supposed to go real quick. Say what's up. Yep. <laughs> so yeah, y'all, we about to go in here and get us some food. It's our first meal of the day. Two o'clock. That's not good. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's so funny because like it's probably gonna be a whole bunch of white people in here. <laughs> Don't take this the wrong way, y'all. But it's probably gonna be like a I mean you probably gonna see some like <laughs> No for real. Yeah, okay, that's what I said. We got up the car. I was like, okay, there's he one. That's what I said he worked here. But anyways, um, yeah, you probably gonna you get what I'm saying. <laughs> But you used to it from where you from. Yeah. It's nothing. I'm used to like a bunch of black people. Nah. We yeah. Ain't you like, I'm not used to that. I mean, that ain't black people. I don't even have my tripod. Y'all ought to see how I'm holding my camera. Like mixed drinks y'all have. I have a full bar. Don't do anything frozen. Right. Right. What kind of tequila they got there? Or you don't think we need to have another drink? I don't know. Dang, the light is behind us. Here we go with this bullshit again. Customer service. Zero out of ten. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> Highly sure. don't recommend. If you don't that want to fish for late platter. I feel like. But I'm still with my food that she be good. Two but sides, this could be oh, zero out of ten. What you want to get? Catfish for like I'm just letting it order my food. I don't know how to eat this drink. This is a blue crab claw. Is that? I, I don't know. Let me do that. I don't know about that. Because I, I don't think. I don't know if it matters, right? He wanna fuck with us. Tell me to pull up with us. Just wanna have fun with us. He can't. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Baby. Yeah. I took a half and she took the whole thing. So. What's up, you guys? So it is actually the next day. I'm actually getting ready to do my makeup um, and I look crazy because I'm about to actually do eyeshadow today. I have not done eyeshadow on myself in such a long time. I had a client the other day and I just feel like I want to like, one, I want to wear eyeshadow tonight and two, I kind of want to brush up on my eyeshadow skills so we kind of plan and make up at the same time. But I'm also kind of like rushing. So my eyeshadow is going to be nothing too crazy but there's definitely going to be um some shadow up there. I'm thinking just a matte white shadow look or something like that, either a nude or red lip. I'm actually getting myself ready to go to my friend's Arache, um birthday party. And she basically got a section at this um, bar slash lounge downtown. And we're about to go have some fun, celebrate her for her birthday. So I literally just got back from Huntsville, maybe not even 30 minutes ago, you guys. Um, Jazz actually had uh, this basketball gig to do, so I went down there with her. Um, after we ended up leaving the Oyster Bar, it was so random. Like, I literally packed my stuff, like, real quick. I packed case and stuff, and I was out of here, girl. I thought I had grabbed my camera, but obviously I did not. So, um, I don't know if I want to insert snaps from last night. We didn't do a whole lot. 
and I didn't snap a whole lot so we'll see that's why you guys should be following me on snap but keep in mind snap is a judge free zone so whatever you see on my snap we don't talk about we just watch okay because that's how you get blocked okay y'all know I love y'all though but I be having to block people sometimes like for real for real because what you're not gonna do is you're not gonna screenshot and screen record my snapchats that's what we not doing okay hacked I don't give a damn like I don't care about nothing what you're talking about that's what we not doing because I feel like um, my snap for me is like my social media platform that I can fully express myself um, without being judged and I also feel like it is my social media platform where um, I can kind of keep tabs of like who's like watching well that's all social media but like who's like screen recording or you know I can I can find out who the poo shiesties are okay that's what it's giving so that's why I do um, enjoy snap so if you want to see a different little eh, side of you girl follow me over on there but yeah we had so much fun uh, we end up going out and it was just like a quick day turnaround so we had to wake up super early in the morning which was not good y'all because we all were like done everybody was done but I had so much fun I got a chance to actually meet some of her um friends because obviously I'm her new friend but um it was nice to meet some of her people they were cool Good vibes, good times. I was so mad that I left my phone though. I meant my camera, y'all. I was like, damn, how in the hell did I leave my camera? But of course, I really wasn't gonna vlog too any um too much anyway because I'm just not up for throwing the camera up in people's face that I don't even know. You know what I'm saying? It's like, girl, where you coming from? And quite frankly, I just enjoy doing things um in private sometimes. And without my camera, especially when it's involving my friends, because I don't want my friends to feel like just because um i'm like into social media and i'm on youtube or whatever um that they have to always be a part of that or they always have to see me pulling the camera out um even though that's one of the things i love most about um, my friendship with jazz is that she literally is that friend that does not like she supports me like if if she need to grab the camera and sh she want to get some content she gonna do that and my boy brandon y'all you guys saw both of them in my last vlog but i love that for them um for me because they make me feel 100 percent comfortable with the camera and when i'm vlogging they don't make me feel weird they don't feel weird they already know what it is and they go with it but sometimes i'm like okay maybe i should chill because i'm always like you know in my camera but they're my friends that be like why you wouldn't bring your camera get your content like Everybody need those type of friends in their life. Like, I need those hold me accountable type of friends. Like, get your content, girl. Period. But let me go ahead and finish doing my makeup because I feel like I'm kind of f***ing it up low-key. Um, not really, but yeah. Um, let me do this and then I'm going to talk to you guys once I'm done doing my makeup. See y'all in like two seconds. <laughs> Alexa, stop. Trying to get y'all right. Y'all, I'm running a little bit behind, but my makeup is done. Um, I just got to do my lip real quick. I was going to do red, but I think a nude will do me just fine. Um, I need to put on some lotion, put on some jewelry, which is right here. Um, and I may have time to do like a few TikToks, at least like three. <laughs> I don't know, but uh, we're going to see. I thought about doing my little signature lip with like the red tint. That would have been really pretty too. But um, to keep things kind of classy, I guess, because my eyes are super cute. Yeah. The skills ain't went nowhere. <laughs> thought I lost it. I need to sharpen this. Girl, I don't have time because if I sharpen this, I don't want to mess up my outfit. And then I'm wearing all white, y'all. It's an all white party, by the way, if I didn't already tell y'all that. Oh, it's giving. So I'm about to, oh, I should have pulled like two pieces down. That would have been cute. But anyways, y'all, I'm about to um, put on my shoes, put on my jewelry, put some lotion on, grab my bag, do a few TikToks. And I got to get out the door because um, I'm already like running a little bit behind. Um more behind than what i wanted to so um let's pick a fragrance real quick 
I love this one. And this is um, the fragrance that I actually took with me um, to Huntsville. And I wore the entire weekend. So this is Zara Rose Gourmand. I really love this one, you guys. It's very unique like no other. I believe it's like a dupe for um, Delina. And Butter actually has the original and it smells so good on her. Like every time she wear it, I always know what she wear and she be smelling so good. And yeah, real good. I just did the absolute most. Let me go put some um body oils and lotions and stuff on. And then um I'm gonna show y'all my outfit and then I'm gonna head out the door. Please ignore the background, you guys. I'm rushing. I don't have time to clean up per usual. Y'all already know what it's like when you're trying to get ready. This is my outfit. I got this cute two-piece from um, Shein. I'm going to step back so y'all can see. Yeah, it's giving. And then I have on the shoes that I showed you guys. This small Kurt Geiger bag. It's literally three things in here. I'm going to show you guys what's in this bag. And I'm going to go ahead and take my camera with me. Uh, maybe we can do a little bit of car vlogging. I always feel like when it's time to vlog, I'm always rushing. But anyways, um, let's go ahead and go because I really don't have any more time to spare. I don't want to be late. Um, and I want to make sure I enjoy the turn up with my girl for her birthday. Period. Yeah, super cute. I love how I defined the curls in my hair. The body is bodying, if you can't tell. All right. Let me go. Uh, we are on the way. It has rained enough today. Like, I'm over the rain. It rained all the way back. Um, on the way back from Huntsville, y'all. It was just crazy. Like, for no reason. So, this is my Kurt Geiger bag, you guys. I'm trying to get it to close. I love this bag. Um, would I buy another one? Only if it's on sale. Because these bags are even smaller than my Gucci um marmont bag so if you think those bags are small this bag is extra small like it's like maybe even half of that i'm giving coco jones at the bet awards don't play with it yeah mm -hmm. so when packing this little bitty bag you have to be very strategic you guys so i'm gonna show y'all real quick while we get a red light so i just have my um maybelline fit me powder Oh, you just turned green. I have this Lancome Juicy Tubes. Y'all probably can't see because I have the light on um, on my tripod. And sorry I'm chewing this gum like a damn horse, okay? But it's good. And I wanna make sure my breath is breathing, period. And then I also just got this um, miniature lipstick. This is MAC Velvet Teddy. I actually don't have on Velvet Teddy, but I have to use what I have miniature of, especially for this bag. Like you need the tiniest samples that you can find in your collection. But um, I actually have on my favorite Wet n Wild brown lip liner that I wear with everything. It's only a dollar, girl, go get you one. And then I have on Urban Decay Stark Naked Lipstick. And I haven't rocked my Urban Decay lipsticks in a long time, but this combo is super pretty. And then I just have on the MAC Clear Gloss, which I love because it's so juicy, like it's so clear. Like, the lips gonna be sitting like this all night. And I also went a little bit heavier on my brown eyeliner. Well, brown lip liner. What the fuck am I talking about? And I don't plan on staying. Well, I mean, look at the time that I'm going. Real long. Because, y'all, honestly, I'm tired. Like, I really am. Oh, my girl know that I love her. But I'm tired. I just got back. Shit, not even three out, two or three hours ago. And Auntie is tired. Okay? And it's time to go lay it down. So you guys, um, I may vlog a little bit while I'm in here. I really don't know. Um, 
y'all know we read the room and we peep out the vibes and if i don't i'm gonna see you guys in the morning because we going to church okay i've been going to church and i've been loving it there so see you guys soon <laughs> And I'm bad like the Barbie. I'm a dog, but I still wanna party. Pink felt like I'm ready to bend. I'm a 10, so I pull in a can. But the Barbies is pretty. Damn. One of the Barbies is bad. It girls. And we ain't playing tag.